Hello, Hello? My friend. How are you? I hear you. Go ahead. What do you want to say to us? Yeah, please. Um, Let us see. Mute you too, please. Can you hear me? Yeah, I do. Go ahead. Show me one Quran verse that uh, shows Muhammad own his slave. Does this story seem possible? Is this story true? Yes, it is. You're right. It's fact. Yes, it happened. This one took place. One Quran verse, Muhammad own slave? Yes. Okay, if I show you what you would do. Well, then you prove yourself to be correct. All right. So you think the Quran never say Muhammad have a slave? Is that what you think? Say that again. So you think that Muhammad in the Quran never owned slave according to the Quran? He never, the Quran never said that. This so is why you are sure? Yeah. You are sure, right? Okay. No way. We got you. Read for me this verse. Chapter 33, verse number 50. What really happened here? Read, read. I want to hear you, you know. I like to hear Quran. I enjoy Quran. Show me one Quran verse that shows Muhammad Onisli. Muhammad Onisli. Well, what's happening? Can you put the Arabic? You read it in Arabic, here we go. I mean, I, people, they are listening to me in English. You read it in Arabic, no problem. You speak Arabic, supposedly? Yeah, I can speak Arabic. Okay, go ahead. Go back to the Arabic version. It's in Arabic already, and you do not need to show me. I mean, open your Quran. Don't you have a Quran at home? G G O O O O G G L A L A E E Gulu Gulu Do you need to call a friend or somebody? Yeah, can you translate it please? Wama Malakat Yaminik? Don't tell me can't you translate? You say to me. Show me one verse in the Quran saying Muhammad have his slaves, and here we go. This is your Muslim. This is your Muslim translation saying, "Whom your right hand possess." One second, let me find hmm. this one. Sorry. Which verse? This one. What's wrong with you? How many times I had to repeat? So you are reading and you are opening the Quran, and you do not know what verse yet. I told you, chapter thirty-three, verse number fifty. Relax. Don't be nervous. Shep it's okay, Allah will send Jibreel to support you. Are you there, my friend? So look what happened. You were so excited. You want to call me. You are desperate to prove to me because you never heard that the Quran saying Muhammad has a slaves. This has happened because you are not talking to someone like me. Don't challenge Christian Prince. So now you're a prophet. He owns slaves. And not only he owned them, he kidnapped them from their families. So what do you want to say to us? I can't find it here. Is it correct? You have some friends there helping him. Three, four people still they can't answer. How's that? Jibri can't answer. Read the Arabic again. Mm. Shall I go and take a shower and come back? I mean, what happened? The verse is small. Come on, tell us something. What do you want to say? Can we see the Arabic again? I showed you the Arabic, and then you asked me to go to the English. And now you say me the Arabic. What's wrong with you? I mean, I give you the verse. You have the book. Tell us what do you think. I'll call you back in two minutes. Oh, you want to call me back? Where, where are you going? I have four wives waiting for me. 
I mean, 13. Two minutes, two minutes. What two minutes? Where you gonna, where you wanna go? Are you with me? Are you are asking me, am I yes. with you? I am sleeping already. I'm waiting for you. Yeah, go ahead. All right, you understand, uh, you understand Arabic, yeah? So if I say this in uh, in Arabic, so uh, you No, I understand. don't understand Arabic. Speak yeah. in English. You call me in English, I, speak in English. We are an English program. I want I, people to hear you. I want people yeah. to hear your answer. You yeah, call me, I, you call I, me, I you, you ask me the question in English. So you oh, need right. to answer oh. first in right. English, please. We are talking right now about Quran and Quran is revealed in Arabic language and and to translate. It doesn't matter. Arabic okay, the Quran is in Arabic. The Quran is in Arabic and the translation yes, made by Arabic. Muslim in the front of us. So if Stop speak, playing games. So if you speak Arabic, if if you speak Arabic, I am going. I'm going to tell you exactly what does that. Mean I, maybe Arabic. I don't speak Arabic. What's wrong with you? you? Maybe I don't. But my Arabic okay. is very weak. The only the Arabic word I know is Bismillah al Rahman al Rahim. So what? This is not a, you know. Not a, no, 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 no. I'm I'm going. I'm 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 going to explain exactly what uh, what is written over there in in Arabic language. Hmm. What is written there in Arabic language? Go ahead. All right. Okay. The meaning of this ayah. Hmm. Yeah. يقول تعالى يقول الله تعالى مخاطبا النبي يا بأنه قد أحل له من النساء أزواجه التي أعطاهن مهورهن. You know what the meaning of مهورهن. وهي الأجور ها هنا كما قال مجاهدا وغير واحد. وقد كان مهر وقد كان مهره لنسائه اثنتي عشر وقية وإنش. What does this have to do with my topic? What does have to do with my topic? Read for us what it says. His right hand possess. Okay. وما ملكت يمينه وما ملكت يمينه. Which is your right hand possesses. Yeah. Wonderful. What does that mean? What does that mean? That means that means أي ما أباح لك مما أخذت من المغانم المغانم which is what you have. Get it from if from the war you won. Okay, so so are they are those our slaves? Are those our slaves? No, 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 no. Maganim, maganim. What does what does maganim mean? Maganim. If if you know Arabic. Okay, are they are the TV? So 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 you are are you saying that your prophet is allowed to have sex with the TV? Is that a maganim? Is that a woman or it is a TV? Maganim, it's a uh, maganim. Anything can be maganim. What it, it is? It, no, what it is? No, 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 no. Listen, listen. Okay. Let me, let okay. me. Let, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Have you ever heard? Have you? Ever, okay, let me ask you. What interpretation you are you are reading from? Excuse me. What interpretation book you are reading from? I'm telling you the sharh of uh, of the ayah. Okay, from which interpretation? <laughs> what is the name? What? The Sharah, the Sharah. What is the name of the interpretation? What is the scholar? What is name? The, the scholar of this one? Hmm. What Ibn happened? Kathir. Ibn Kathir, that's wonderful. Okay, guys, did he say Ibn no, Kathir? No, hang on, hang on, hang on, hold on, hold on. No. Okay, you chose Ibn no, Kathir. That's it. We will go to Ibn Kathir. We will not waste time. Here we go. I will go to Ibn not, Kathir. It's not Ibn Kathir. My it's friend, Ibn no problem. Is Ibn Kathir is good for you or not? Is no, Ibn... sorry. It's, it's the Sha'rawi. It's the Sha'rawi. Okay, is Ibn Kathir good for you or not? No, Sha'rawi. Go to Sha'rawi. I'm asking you, is Ibn Kathir is good for you or not? It, de it depends what Ibn Kathir you have. If if it's the Ibn Kathir Shia version of, or it is the Ibn original Kathir Ibn Shia version. I never heard of Ibn Kathir Shia version. Ibn Kathir is a Muslim Sunni. Of course. Yeah. No, 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 no. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. On, on, the, inter on, on the internet, there is. Uh, uh, yeah, 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 okay. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Mr. Shia, Mr. Shia version, Mr. Shia version. Was Bilal a slave of the Prophet of Allah or not? No. No. <laughs> no. Okay. You was Ma that? was Mary the cooked a slave? Was Mary the cooked? Was Mary the? Well, listen. You was Mary was Mary the cooked a slave of the Prophet of Allah? Yes or no? You have. You have no true evidence of what you are saying. Well, I just showed you. It says, okay, everybody will see. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on in front of us. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, Abdul. Abdul, listen, listen. Okay, this is your Muslim translation. It says they are saying those are 
or th what those what okay listen listen the translation in front of you it says those who they are the prisoners of war it's in the front of you even your muslim got you busted with your lies it says the prisoners of war is the tv a prisoner yeah, of war yeah, of course the prisoners of war and the prophet muhammad with the presence of war he he offered them to te anyone any one of them can uh, can read and uh, can uh, can write and read to teach muslim people and then he will get his but freedom usually, but the that verse here is speaking about war. having sex with them this verse here is speaking about having sex it's lawful for you okay, what about your wives about about Listen, Bilal. you say to me, you okay. challenge me, so you agreed now. Bilal. So you agree. So you agree. Uh, you ag okay, hold on. So one by one, we will go to Bilal. So you agreed that you're a prophet. He owned slave girls. Yes or no? Let me ask you. Did you a prophet? He owned slave girls. Yes or no? Either you say yes. It says that they are captive of war, or you say no. You mentioned Bilal. I, I will show you Bilal. I'm asking you before we change. Before we go. Before we go to Bilal. Did your prophet own slaves from war and they are women and he raped them? Yes or no? Show us your proof for Bilal. It's in the front of you. What Bilal? Bilal, he did not rape him yet. He raped women. Now we're talking about women. I showed the, because you said to me, show me Quran. So now this is the Quran. Then I will go to the Hadith of Bilal. Hmm? What happened? Bilal. Hmm. Yeah, Bilal. So? Did your prophet own girls and he sleep with them? Yes or no? Here we go. You said to me you are reading Tafsir al Sharawi, right? Okay, here we go. This is a Sharawi, and the Sharawi getting you busted. Why you are lying? Are you there? You said yes. to me you are reading a Sharawi. It says, Inna mil al -asra fi harbin mashru'a. So they are prisoners, and those are females. So why you are saying here we go? It says it says too. وَمِلْكُ الْيَمِينِ قَدْ يَكُونُ مِنَ النِّسَاءِ فَتَدْخُلْ فِي نِسَائِهِمْ أَوْ يَكُونُ مِنَ الصُّبْيَانِ So they can be women or even boys. So you're a prophet. Is lawful for him to have sex with women and boys? This is a Sharawi. This is the tafsir you are reading from. It's in the front of my eyes. What you are talking about? You are reading from a shadow, you right? This is a this is a shadow. You read for me. Does it say does it hard up listen 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 does it say read with me read with me when you you say you are reading from a shadow everybody heard you you know something you are playing with the word you are mixing I am not this is a shadow this is a shadow this is a shadow that means the little boys the boys they they still babies you mean who are the malikatu you mean it is lawful for you okay that's the Quran says okay listen 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 and it says well what does mean our tibli ladin lam yadharu ala awrat nisa that is the babies the babies haha you are mixing with okay, the word okay listen, listen 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 no. listen you said you are reading a, a, a sharawi and a sharawi saying malikat al yameen is the capture of war of women and children and it's lawful for you to have sex with them this is what it says in the front of you so what we will do now And I can open right now in English. Where is the part for the women? It says here in front of you. You, you claim you speak Arabic, right? Here we go. It says, "Idnun fi al ala al-mar'a," and then, "Malakat aymanahum al-ahdab." Fifty-five. "Qulna inna milk al-yamina yati min al-asra fi harb mashru'a," and then he continues saying that this is "qad yakoon min al-nisa fatadkhul fi nisaihin." And this is a yeah, Sharawi. Yes, yes. What's what's wrong with that? If it's woman, okay, she joined the the woman. 
This okay. is what you are saying so in Arabic. She, he, so but you're a prophet, he owned. Own. Okay, so you're a prophet. So you're a prophet. So you're a prophet, he owned a slave. Okay. You know something? Listen, listen, listen. So you're a prophet. Did he own those women? You're a prophet. Did you? Okay. Listen, listen, listen. Listen, listen. Okay. Listen, 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 listen. Listen. Let me let me get you busted. Let me get you busted one by one. Okay. Read for me. here to join. It's different than what you are saying. No problem. Abdul. Listen. Listen, Abdul. Join. Listen. Listen. The woman. If it's woman to join the woman. If it's his kids to to join the kids. But it's not to, to have sex with the women. Or okay. Sex with okay. Hold, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Read this hadith for me. I don't want to hold on. You are mixing the word with you. No, we are not. We are it's not mixing. And here we are getting you busted. Did your, your did your prophet? You did your mind. prophet <laughs> rape Sophia? <laughs> did your exactly prophet you kidnap? Did your no, prophet have a gift? Hold on. I, I will get you busted in front of everyone. Your a prophet. Your a prophet. I will name for you, and we will show you reference one by one. This is the first verse we showed you. It says that your prophet is lawful for him to have sex with any slave woman he own. And the top of that, any Muslim woman, she can give herself to the prophet. S secondly, listen, is it true that before we go there, is it true that if the prophet, his eyes fall into a woman, the prophet, the, the husband must divorce her so the prophet, he can have her. What are you showing on the screen? I'm asking you, is it true? If you're a prophet, his eyes fall into a woman. The husband must divorce the wife so he can have her. What's your proof? Here we go. And I'm glad that you speak Arabic. We can't see anything. All right, a second. Don't hang up. Where do you hang up? Here we go. It's there. Don't go. Potato. Why you hang up? What? Here we go. This is the official government of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia website. And this is Tafsir al qurtubi And you speak Arabic. Now let us see what it says there. And this is explaining to the same verse we are talking about here. About Malikatul Yameen. You see it? In the front of us. How do we know, how huh? do we know what you are showing us? It's a true. It what? is. Here we go. Oh, here we go. This is the address. I, I will show. I will show the address. Don't stop lying. You can. You can go right now, and everybody will see if this is really the official government website of Saudi Arabia. Here we go. Look at the address. Quran su dot education dot sa. So yes, is true, and this is Tafsir al Qurtubi. And now we go and we see what Tafsir al Qurtubi is saying, and you can open from your side Tafsir al Qurtubi. I read with me. If I am lying, then I'm saying I'm lying. And now you are you speak Arabic, so you have no excuse. Here we go. Let us see. It says what and what Muhammad did. Read with me carefully. The Prophet he had many privilege, and those are the privilege of the Prophet. We will start from here. This is Tafsir al Qurtubi. Starting from privilege number one. Do you see the screen with me? <clears throat> Do you see the screen? Yes, but it's late. All right, no problem. Do you see it now? Yes. All right. You speak Arabic, right? Don't tell me you don't speak Arabic. Can you read for us what is there? Do you want me to give you the link so you can read it from your side? Read for me the line number 10, the very privilege number 10. إِذَا وَقَعَ بَصَرَهُ عَلَىٰ إِمْرَأَ وَجَبَ عَلَىٰ زَوْجَهَا طَلَاقُهَا If the Prophet, his eyes fall into a woman, which means he like her, the husband, he must divorce her. So the Prophet... Where is that? He, where, so where, the, is that? where is that? This go is back, the Seer Al-Qurtubi. It's in the front of your that? eyes. Show me that. Show me that. Show me that. I'm showing you Stop. that. It's in the front of you. No, no. Where is it? Where is that? I'm showing you. It's in the front of you. You to be sleep. All right. So, so this one. How how would I know that what you are telling us right now, it is true from the tafsir? 
be very easy. You can open the tafsir from your side and you read it. I mean, how? what a big deal. You can open the book of tafsir and you can read it. Very easy, in front of everybody. This is in the book of Al-Qurtubi, page number 187. Tafsir Al-Ahzab, verse number 50. What's happening? You speak Arabic, you do not need 10 hours to, uh, to come with the answer. What kind of a prophet, if a woman walk in front of him and she is married, and she is a Muslim, her husband must divorce her so the prophet, he can jump on her. And this is Arabic, and this is al Qurtubi, and I give you the page number, and I give you the Islamic website, and this is the official government website of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. I'm opening this website and I can't find what you are saying right now. You are now. lying, I'm my friend. It's in the front of me. Here we go. I will give you I will give you the link. Stop lying. Here we go. This is the link. Open it from your side. I give it to you in Skype. You see here. He, he he's playing with the word it is the same ya ayyuh nabi inna bahna laka azwajaka allati a'taytahunna muhurhunna wa bahna laka ma malakat yaminukum min al-ima don't jump what i'm saying to you read it how come you are not reading what i'm giving you does it say there that if the prophet his eyes fall into a woman her husband must divorce her so the prophet he can f her yes or no Just check in the verses, okay? No problem. I wonder why it's taking you so long. I'm giving you the, the, the link. This is the Islamic government website of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, official. And you are still chicken. I don't know what chicken. I mean, what? It's in front of you. What's happening now? Why is taking two of you? Like, are you both of you shake? You grow beard? So two shakes, they cannot answer a line in their book. So look what we proved. That yes, your prophet, he owned hundreds of his slaves and he raped them. In the top of that, if a woman, she walk in the front of him and she is married, still he have the right to take her and strip her from her husband and he jump on her. And you are in disability, and you speak Arabic, you have no excuse. Can you show us Bilal in the meantime? No problem. We will go to Bilal. Don't worry. <laughs> this is bigger than Bilal. What kind of a prophet? And not only that, we will show you Bilal and we will show you that Bilal begging for his freedom. Just wait. It's coming. But one by one. I can't find anything. Send you the email. Yes. The email. It's interesting. Not any sources like that uh, to find this one. What, uh, what he's saying? I'm interested when you um, cut the conversation. Send it to this. Uh, iCloud. Uh, so what's happening now? Why is it taking so long? Yeah. The iCloud. Trying to confirm this uh, KSU 
website. Oh, what come from? I gave you the website, and this is the official government of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. You can click down. It says contact us, and it will take you to the official government of Saudi Arabia. And you do not need this website, by the way. You can just search the sentence in Google, and you will find all your Islamic books saying that. You do not need even the website I gave you. Give us two minutes. We'll call you back, yeah? Well, you want to two minutes? So come on, just uh, finish it. Don't you want to go to Bilal? We, we have many. We have Bilal, we have many women, Muhammad, he raped them. We have the evidence, we have the reference, we have the page number, we have the hadith number, and you will be having fun for the rest of the night. This is the start. We are just saying hello. Yeah, I need to get my charger. Ah, the charger, it's both of you. Why both of you will hang up? You don't need a charger. You have no answer. It's a shameful prophet. Let's go to Bilal first. What Bilal now? Uh, this is more important. And we will go to Bilal. Don't worry. Do you think you can answer for Bilal? If you cannot answer for this one, you can answer for Bilal. Everybody knows that Bilal is a slave of a prophet. What's wrong with you? Every single Muslim in the world knows that Bilal is a slave of the prophet. Are you kidding me or what? <laughs> I mean, even Muslims, they are texting me in Skype saying, tell this guy we are Muslims, but he's wrong. The prophet, he owned many slaves. Even Muslims are upset from you. Bilal was the first black sheikh. Uh, my friend, your Bilal did not get his freedom even from your prophet. Your Bilal, he got, we, when Muhammad he died, he came to Abu Bakr saying, Abu Bakr, if you bought me because, because Bilal was a gift from, from Abu Bakr to Aisha. <laughs> he said to him, if you bought me for the sake of yourself, will keep me for your sake of yourself. But if you bought me for the sake of Allah, free me. Is that true? What's your proof? Yeah, okay, no problem. You are talking to Christian Prince. Where's your proof? Here we go. This is the proof. Read it. The YouTube is slow. It's not YouTube, it's slow, my friends. It's you. You are ashamed of your prophet. You do not know what to say. Where did you get this from? Don't change the topic. You, you see, I'm talking to two. One of you now, I want you to think about Bilal's story. And the other yeah. one, he need to answer me. The other one, he need to answer me, two of you. So you cannot keep busy in one thing. One of okay, you need Bilal. to answer me. I need an answer about your prophet. I gave you two okay. things already. I call you three okay. things, actually. Okay. And you Bilal. cannot answer anything. Okay. Okay. You so, are saying about Bilal, okay? You said, you said Bilal. No, said no, no. He is the one talking to Bilal. You, you, I gave you time to read about your prophet having sex with women who they are not his wives. He forced the husband to divorce them. Why you are you changing the topic? What are you doing? Are you trying right. to escape the disaster? I gave no, you. No, no, no. Okay, no, then answer. No, no, but, then answer. No, but, the privilege of the prophet. They are 17, 19 privilege. Number, number 10. If the prophet, his eyes fall into a woman, her husband must divorce her and he can F her. So you took all this time to jump to Bilal, right? Because Bilal will rescue you. No, you cannot do that with me. And here we go. I showed you Bilal about Bilal. Bilal begging for his freedom, saying, if you bought me for the sake of yourself, keep me for the sake of yourself. If you bought me for the sake of Allah, leave me for the sake of Allah. So? Let us be honest. You are ashamed, aren't you? One second. Hmm. <clears throat> Who was of you is the sheikh? Both of you are sheikh or only one of you? I'm talking to shaky sheikh. Do you know how many times you told me one second? Did you decide to leave Islam? Isn't it obvious that Muhammad is a bad man? He look at a woman, her husband must divorce her? This is a gang leader. This is not a prophet. My friend is checking the KSU website too. <laughs> I feel sorry for you. <laughs> <laughs> you 
you're a prophet he received he received gifts as a human being he used to receive gifts in amazon free shipping and handling maria the cop her cousins her sisters her niece her nephews he, he received them as gift and he kept them as a slave and he raped them what about Sophia, the one who kidnapped her? What about Bani Mustaliq, who he attacked them and he take all the women and he raped the women and he exchanged her with Dahya Al-Kalbi? <laughs> they hang up the cowards. Potatoes. Literally, potatoes. The liar, he said, that Malikatul Yameen is Maghanim, which means uh, like he stole TV. The prophet is lawful for him, the TV. This verse is speaking about, you can have sex with the following, you liar. You can have sex with the following. You are an official liar, and you have no dignity. And then what we do? We hang up and we run. And this is Ibn Kathir, the one you choose from the beginning. He owned Sophia and he owned Juria, and they are counting you how many, and Maria and Shamoon and the mother of Ibrahim. Those are many women. He owned them in the booty and some of them as a gift. And this is Ibn Kathir in the front of you, you coward liar. I wish always Muslims who speak Arabic they will call me because they make my life a lot easier. Hey guys, did we have fun? They are gone. Potato, 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 potato. They are gone. What a shameful cult. A prophet and yet. His followers, if a woman she walk by and he like her, you know, he say to the husband, divorce her right now. I want her. And the husband immediately, it's a privilege. Imagine they are saying it's a privilege to the prophet that if his eyes fall into a woman, her husband must divorce her. And he did that with his own son. The story is even mentioned in the Quran about Zaid and Zainab. He went to the house of Zainab and he flirted with Zainab and he said to her, Praise be to Allah, the one who made my heart flip for you. Look how filthy he is. Imagine you have somebody you trusted him, not necessarily a father. In this case, Muhammad is the father of the guy he adopted him, which means the guy he trusted him to come inside his house when he is not there for he is his father. And what he do when the husband is away, the hyena play. He come to the house and he flirt with the wife. And the wife, obviously, she don't want to be with the, someone like Zaid. She want to be with the, the one who is going to become a king, Muhammad. She want to be a wife for this man who now ruling thousands of fighters, not this little tiny one. So she told the husband, your father was here and he said that to me, he flirt with me. So the son, he went to his father, trustworthy father, and he said, oh, you know what? I don't like this woman no more. No, you don't like her. Yes, because he's just heard that Muhammad, you he want her. If you don't give her, he will kill him. 